Okay, go slowly. I hope you like this chord, because the whole song, almost the whole song, you're going to be doing this with your right hand. Uh, so that's what it starts out on. Your left hand is going to be a B and a G flat. And your right hand is going to be a B, D, G flat. Then you're going to hit a D. Remember this pattern. You're going to hit a D, then these two at the same time, a G and a G flat and a high B. So that's how that goes. Next chord, your left hand's going to drop down to an E octave. Right hand is going to be, uh, actually, instead of playing a G flat, you're going to play a straight G, but just the first time you hit this chord. Then you're going to go back to doing So the second chord goes like this. Next chord, right hand's doing the same thing again, but your left hand is going to go to a G octave. This is where it gets a little different. You're going to drop down to a G flat octave in the left hand, and the right hand, you're going to play an A, D, or sorry, A, D flat, G flat. But then, yep. You go back to this one. So just like when you played this chord, the first time you're going to hit the new chord, but then you're going to go right back to... So what, what do we have so far? starts repeating, you're going to play in the left hand just an E octave. Right hand is going to be, uh, just hit this one at first, just hit a B, and then work your way down with the right hand. That's a G flat, E, D, D flat, B. And then play around with these three. to do it. <clears throat> now most of the song, you're just going to repeat what we just did. But here's the thing, uh, with the intro, you do that pattern twice, but the second time, uh, let's say we just ended. Instead of playing the chord like this, play it like this. You're hitting the same, the same keys, you're just moving your right hand and your left hand up a little bit to play a G or a B octave with a G flat and then just a D and a G flat. That way you can hit this high uh, same chord, just playing high B, then A, then G flat, then D. So it sounds like this. Uh, let's say we just end it again. Do that twice. Right hand stays the same but your left hand's going to drop down to an E octave. Like I said, right hand does the exact same thing it did before. <clears throat> then we go...
go back to what's the next chord again? This one. Just hit that once. Now instead of doing this, <clears throat> you're going to do this little fill. Just hit this once. That's an A, B, D flat, D. Do that twice. Next chord, do the same fill. Uh, instead of ending it on a D, I think the first time you can hit, uh, end it on an A. So it sounds like... That's how the intro goes. Just do it all uh, straight through, all the way once. Second time, bring your right hand up. It's really just doing different fills. Same chords. And then you can start uh, the singing part. Come here. that all the way through once, uh, then you do it all the way through again when you sing I've been waiting patiently, and then when you get to the part where he sings uh, uh, I didn't but now I see, now I can see, I think that's what it is, there's one surprise chord in there. You're going to start out exactly the same as you did with all the other ones. This time, you're going to hit E octave in the left hand, right hand is going to be a B, E, A flat. And it's going to be the same pattern as this, but just with these fingers. And all I'm doing is I'm working my way down, and on the way down I'm adding a G flat. chords we were doing earlier. Remember how to play this one? This time you're just gonna roll the right hands into this. See how I'm adding a, a, an A in there? Then hit this. And play around with the E, the D, and the G flat. Right hand stays exactly the same, just drop your left hand down to an E. Just do that one once, and then go to this chord, and just... Do that, and then this is a new chord here. Bring your left hand down to a G flat. And right hand is going to play an E, D flat, B flat. So this is what we have.
as often as you want. And when you think you're done, after you do the last chord here, just end it on uh, the opening chord. Um, yep, that's how to play Go Slowly.